today's adventure was not meant to be ice cream. I started out to the local Harley shop, which I ended up there, but it was very small. Nice people, not much to not much to see, not much to show. I think they only had like 10 bikes inside, 12 bikes inside maybe, not a lot. But the ice cream farm or the dairy farm that I wound up, here is a little bit of history on the Murdoch Dairy Farm. It is 100% farm made homemade ice cream. It is in Winchenden, Mass, and it has been that way since 1964. Um, it is seasonal. They do shut down for the winter. The property history Murdoch Farm was established in, can't read that, let's bring that up, 1885 by Peter Murlock. Henry uh henry gerard bought murdoch farm in 1959 and him and his family uh have owned it ever since in 2009 it was put into conservation they protected let's see let's see if i can find the total number 99 acres 72 acres 24 acres 42 acres, so what is that, 100, 172, 200, so let's say about 250 acres that they protected. It is in a farm conservation and can never be um, anything else. It is being currently run by a sixth generation of the family. It stopped being a farm farm, I did see that somewhere. I think I read 2021, but of course I can't find that number now. It says each year the ice cream stand brings thousands of people. But it was really cool. It's nice to see history preserved and maintained. And how they are maintaining it is, of course, the conservation and the money they get from the trust and whatnot. But also that little, that little uh, ice cream stand out front apparently is a big deal. It was tiny, it was little, not a lot going on, but it was clean inside, and the service was fast and friendly. I hope they continue to do service for years to come. It was a good afternoon adventure. Just driving around, found this tiny little ice cream stand. We'll see how it tastes. Homemade gluttony for your inner fat kid. This is what an ice cream shop looks like in small camp style <laughs> and apparently I just scared one of the girls that works here it's pretty good it's homemade right on this dairy farm I ended up getting bear tracks which is chocolate ice cream Reese's peanut butter cup and marshmallows it's a very unique combination. Never heard of the marshmallow part before. But it's fresh and homemade. And it's really good. Murdoch Farm Dairy Bar. This is what an old dairy farm looks like. I'm almost 100% sure behind that glass door. There's probably like milk and cheese and stuff like that for people who are local. But I could be wrong, it could just be an office. You can see that people can bring their kids out. And while they're eating their ice cream, they can hit the goats. And then you see some big cows over there. This is how big the farms are out here. Didn't have any food. They didn't want anything more to do with me. But these are the things that you'll actually see on a regular basis, just driving around. 
Then they have little picnic tables. People to eat their ice cream at. This right here that I'm walking up on. This is a big swamp. I can hear everything squishing below me. That is definitely um, some old farm tools. I don't know specifically anymore what it was used for. I'm going to look it up though. They're just using it as decoration now, it looks like. My guess is up where those red racks are, the, the, that's more farmland up there for them. Gotta have a cell tower, their own cell tower apparently. Probably bet you they get decent signal out here. But yeah, this was really cool. I'm glad I uh, took a wrong turn. GPS went out. Gauges went out on the car again. We thought we fixed them. They've been doing well until today. When I came back from Harley. That concludes my little adventure for today. Well, maybe. I saw some signs for antique shops, so that might happen too. Who knows? Love this. Totally peaceful. in Mass. I don't know if I was recording when I said there was an ATV coming up behind me, but that's the kind of shit that people do out here. You see all the stone walls to the right of the right of me? Um, that's those have been around for hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years because that's how they divided the property out here. You had a stone wall around your around your property. Local wildlife. When Mr. I came Turkey. out of the end of the road that I was on, I was immediately on the back road to where I need to be. And across the street is the bank, the credit union that I have been using. I hope you guys have a good week and I will see you later. Bye!